Several governors voicing frustration with President Biden's handling of the U.S.-Mexico border. But the president says House Republicans are to blame for inaction. Edward Lawrence is at the White House with more on the story. Border Patrol releasing hundreds of migrants in San Diego County Friday after the county's shelter became overwhelmed. Meanwhile, California Governor Gavin Newsom joining a group of governors at the White House with border policy top of mind for state leaders. We sent this letter two and a half years ago and simply asked for a meeting. This is the first time we've actually been in one room talking about it. Yeah, so the, I, I will say the frustration level is very high with every single governor in, in that room. President Biden insisting the White House worked with the Senate to to introduce fair and humane border reforms. But then, as we all know, petty politics intervened. The Speaker of the House has refused to vote on the bill, even though, again, there's significant support. Folks, doing nothing is not an option. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis not at the meeting, sending more of his own state's troops to the border. We're going to continue to be in this fight until the problem is solved. President Biden now weighing taking executive action on securing the border, potentially restricting migrants' ability to claim asylum. We did get uh, a general sense that they're looking into whatever they can do on the, uh, on the executive side. Again, keeping our expectations realistic. There's still no timeline on when executive actions may take place, and the White House press secretary still urging Congress to to pass border reform measures at the White House. Edward Lawrence, Fox 32, Chicago.